Who's eating that? Then I saw this and I said, capitalism has gone too far. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. I am trying something new and thought because it's Valentine's season, I would review some Valentine gifts and chocolates and candies. So I went to Target and was introduced to a wide variety of gifts. We've gone too far. It's too much. It is too much. We have to be stopped. Let's just start with classic Russell Stover. Retails for only $6 for, I don't know how many pieces come in it. Nine, pe nine pieces. All right, maybe that's not a good deal. But it's like kind of cute, pretty, pretty straightforward. Um, little ASMR. And now starting with Russell Stover. I don't think I have the voice for ASMR. So this is actually prettier than with that cheap ass red plastic. This is the inside. They could have easily fit probably five more pieces in here. So corporate greed if I've ever seen. This one seems to be chocolate buttercream. Tastes like it was $6.99. Let's see, there's truffle, vanilla cream, peanut cluster, nut caramel, strawberry cream and caramel. All right, I like strawberry, so let me, let me see what that one's giving. All right, Russell, it doesn't taste like strawberry. This is for someone you just started dating. You have to get them something this is for them. So that was a classic Russell Stover. And then I saw Ferrero collection. Who doesn't love a Ferrero Rocher? I bet you all didn't think you were getting an ASMR video. Maybe that should be the title. Valentine's Day ASMR review. This retails for $5.99, eight pieces this time. So same price, one last piece. Okay, well, it's broken. It is cuter than the Russell Stover though, the packaging. There seems to be this one with a flower on it. Can you see that? But I don't understand what flavor that is. These that are dark brown. with a piano on it. These are just the standard. So let me try the flower one, because we're trying things. This is very messy. It's giving coconut. That is coconut. I don't like coconut. That is very messy. But light, the dark one has these little like chocolate beads on them. I don't know how to do this. I'm bad at this. I think it's dark chocolate, which I don't hate, but I don't love. Cute, easy, get it for your secretary at work. Cleanse my palate. Now things are getting crazy. We've gone too far. We've gone over the deep end. I don't even know where to begin. Okay, I'll start with Hershey Kisses. Now what I like is they said, you know what, we're not just giving you chocolates, you're gonna get a stuffed animal as well. It does cost $12.99, but it's two gifts and you're getting 20 pieces. So 20 Hershey Kisses and a stuffed animal for $12.99. I mean, that seems like a bargain. Honestly, he's cute.
We'll call him Kiss. This just looks like scotch tape. They don't even have little pockets. It's just two bags strewn about in there. Hershey, now I know why you did the bear. You're distracting. This is... Jesus Christ. We're not doing a taste test with that. I'm disappointed, Hershey. Now I want my $12 back. If you're thinking, I'm dating someone who loves Star Wars, but it's Valentine's Day. What kind of connection do they have? Well, don't worry. Apparently, there is a connection. So this is Star Wars The Mandalorian with gummy frogs. I've never seen Star Wars, correct me if I'm wrong. This is not a frog, right? Baby Yoda's also felt. This also retails for $6.99. What kind of presentation is this? Disappointing. Just plastic wraps. It's mini plastic bags inside of a larger plastic bag. No wonder our earth is dying. I mean, this looks like Mike Wazowski as well. This is for Valentine's Day. Make them pink or something. It tastes like a gummy bear, but there's no specific flavor. It's just like gummy flavor. But do green apple. I mean, something. We need more. This is not worth Seven dollars. A felt Baby Yoda. Gay. Sparkle on Valentine. What? It cost a dollar fifty. Give it to your kids to take to school. Oh, it's rainbow. We're not allowed. This was there. What? A gummy blue raspberry controller. And it is Valentine's because you can say to and from somebody. There's not a heart on it. If there's not... Okay, this is hefty. The packaging fell apart instantly. Who's eating that? That is... That is thick gummy, and that's a lot. Who's eating that? That is a gift for someone you don't like. That is a gift for someone you want them to have to pay for dental work. No, I'm giving that to Mateo. As if this hasn't been enough. What? What are we doing here? Meant for you? And I'm not kidding, this is beef jerky. We've gone too far. First of all, Valentine's Day sucks. Are you kidding me? It's empty. <gasps> no. Jack Links, I hope you're watching. I want a refund. Five dollars, empty. I can't even try the beef jerky. Keeps getting worse. SpongeBob. Why, I don't know. This cost seven dollars, which I gotta say, it is kind of cute. And like, this is actually almost like a velvety material. So if you have a kid, this would be very cute. Or an adult who hasn't grown up. You're a ketchup. Includes heart-shaped Krabby Patties gummy candy. That's kind of cute. So it's this. And they're little mini Krabby Patties. Kind of cute. You can eat them separately. Looks like bun, patty, and pickle. And they're all in the shape of a heart. 
they taste gummy, but there's a, a flavor to them. And maybe it's my brain playing tricks on me, but it almost tastes kind of like a burger. That can't be right. Honestly, it's worth it. Give it to your kids. Look, I'm a, I'm a sucker for multi-purpose gifts, like a two-in-one or something that can be used in different ways. So this Nerf has decided to enter the chat. And they're giving a heart box with candy inside and a game. They also had like a football one, I think, an athlete kid or someone with ADD who's an adult and they just like like fidgeting or little games like this. It could be kind of cute. Okay, again, I don't I don't love this. You know, I want little like chocolates. I want little homes for each of them. I don't want these little individuals. This bag is not a toy. Okay, but what is it? Basically made at Fort Knox to get this game open. It's here or nothing. Oh, it's Nerf. It's Nerf or nothing. Well, then it's nothing. And then, oh, shit. And then this cute little basketball. Okay. Oh my God, it's gonna break a tooth. Would they make this of Nerf? This feels like a lot for a toy. Also with no instructions. All right, well, that's the best I can do. Okay, okay. This is to stand it up, I think. And then what am I sticking this into? Stick it back into the box. This is complicated, but it only costs $7. So you're getting gummies and a game. Honestly, I'll never be able to do that again. Then I saw this and I said, capitalism has gone too far. A Lunchables Valentine's. Now don't get me wrong. I loved a Lunchable growing up. What about this other than the heart shape says, be my Valentine or I love you. Here's some gummy crackers and meat. Cheese be my Valentine. This retails for $6. The flavors are watermelon, strawberry, pineapple, and mango. We take the crackers, the meat, which I assume is strawberry, tomato and cheese, I'm guessing. Oh no, this is the cheese. Mango? Okay, so this is one. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh my God. I'm gonna say it. This is the best gummy texture of any of the gummies. It's soft, it's easy to chew, and it kind of does have a fruity flavor that isn't offensive. Okay, Lunchables. I still don't get why it's for Valentine's Day, but I'm not mad at it. Thank you for watching my review. If you liked this video of me reviewing things, let me know in the comments. Um, I'm just trying something new to see what you guys like and what you guys don't like. So please subscribe, like, comment. Let me know if you wanna see more like this. And uh, until next time.